I started hearing people screaming from the complex upstairs. Gunfire erupted inside of this PRP apartment Tuesday night. I heard about five, six shots go off. Leaving people who live nearby on edge. I didn't think nothing of it, but something told me to get up. It sounded like real gunshots. Police say this man, Justin Robinson, got into a physical fight before pulling the trigger and firing multiple gunshots. We're told children were inside of the apartment at the time. 24-year-old Devante Wallum was killed. A neighbor who didn't want to be identified tells WOKY in Wallum's final moments, he protected those children. He was trying to cover up the kids before the whole incident happened. So, you know, it's kind of sad that there was kids in there that had to witness that. Another man was also found shot not too far from the scene on Brick Kiln Lane. That's when I heard a lot of commotion from down there, and then I seen a guy running through the field across the street, and he was stumbling, so I knew he was shot. That man was treated and released. With Robinson now behind bars, residents are relieved. It helps get, you know, people that don't need to be out here on these streets, off these streets. And are sending their condolences to all those mourning a life taken too soon. God bless y'all. You know, prayers is going up for you. You know, shouldn't nobody have to bury a loved one around the holidays, you know, or any day. And it's, it's just a sad situation. Now, detectives say Robinson admitted to the shootings. He's charged with murder, assault, and wanton endangerment, and he's due in court tomorrow morning. We're reporting live from downtown Trey Ward, WOKY News. Thank you, Trey.